Welcome to Still Plays Galaxy of Heroes. This is the final matchup of Season 11. We have dropped two battles. We've already hit Kyber, and we have a tough matchup to wrap it all up with. This is the defense that we're looking at. My opponent here, Cyril Kern, has basically put all of his relics on defense. So we got Geos, JKR, a gas team that will be easily handled. But we're going to run out of teams is the problem. Here is the bottom territory with a good Darth Revan team, a good uh, General Grievous team. And then when you look here at the relics that he has in his roster, we'll sort this by gear tier. This is basically all of his relics except for his Galactic Republic Padme team. And then there's some sporadic like Night Sisters and some other things, uh, Vader. But basically, all of his relic teams are on the front line, and we have a limited amount of teams that we can counter these teams with. Fortunately, he does not have any fleets. He doesn't have Negotiator. He doesn't have Malevolence. So I put both of them on defense here, knowing that he's not going to be able to take those teams out. I put a weak defense here so that he hopefully targets these teams, uses up some of his options, and then gets stuck with my fleets, and then hopefully doesn't have enough to deal with my front wall or uh, my, ba my back wall here. It's going to come down to banners, though, so this is going to be a tough, tough one, and it's why the last video I named calm before the storm because this is what i was expecting to have to deal with and we're definitely going to have to make some strategic choices like i i may just abandon this i might get lucky with my jedi knight revan team but i don't have a relic jolie yet so this team here is i'm basically limited to gas or darth revan for a guaranteed win up against Grievous and then Darth Revan's the same thing I have to use gas there but if I do that then I'm not clearing this top territory because then I'm limited in my other options to take out gas and some of these other teams uh, we are gonna try and feats are gonna be a problem too because basically really my night sister team against this geos team is really the only realistic option or I'm using my Treya team which I, I think is going to get taken out by these Geos uh, and then use that Darth Sidious Darth Maul team but the strategy we're going to go with is because the back wall is worth more with fleets we're going to clear this top territory and then clear uh, clear out the ships and then hopefully uh, we win by banners So we're going to just, we can undersize a 501st team here. That gear 12 gas is not going to be good enough. What, what am I thinking? I could have used my Darth Revan, but that gets a little messy.
Okay. Gas is down again. And we'll be able to clear out the rest of this. This is why I'm handling things the way that I am. I don't really have a good, like I'm basically resorted into using Darth Revan here because I don't have another team that I can really confidently bring up against Jedi Knight Revan now. Except for a mirror, I guess I could do. No, I don't, I, my JKR is not good enough for a mirror. Because I've spread all my relics around it's why I'm a little bit I have a much deeper roster than my opponent I've got Jedi Knight Luke which he doesn't have like he looks like he relatively recently got gas yeah we're gonna do that I was wondering whether or not I'd swap out Sith Trooper or just four man it. But the moment is going to come down to who Jedi Knight Revan marks. Because if... I always forget to do that. I, what I should be doing is hitting Kenobi so the taunt doesn't get triggered. We'll put fear on Revan though. Gain some time. I think we'll do drain life over here. Hopefully, tr no, not quite. Now we can trigger it. Okay. Now here with these Geos, I want to try the Night Sisters. Just to see if we can get that feat, but I don't have the relics. I can handle some Geo teams. Actually, let's put Daka in that slot. But at this, at my gear levels, it's not, it's not consistent. Let's land that stun, no, no luck there. Yeah, let's take off the buffs. Do a mass assist. Let's see if we can put another stun down. Let's do it on soldier.
Get another stun. Let's see if we can put a stun on the brute. Perfect. Let's hit this plague. Let's see if we can stun Sunfect. No luck there. Dispel. Make sure we don't lose. Let's see. Oh, let's hit spy. Perfect. Okay, we'll bring back Spirit. We're still dealing now with Brute. Let's do the Mass Assist. It's gonna be scary. Dispel. Let's bring her back. Let's do the AoE. Now that we've lost Spirit a few times, the damage is ramping up. Now we can hit these plagues. Let's see if we can stun Elf. Perfect. All right. Come on. Let's try and take out Spy. I'd like to get a heal before we wrap. Oh, that's, that's good. All right. That's a nice one. Not a ton of banners. Because all the protection is gone. I just needed any five Night Sisters for that feat, right? Yeah. Okay. Let's jump back in here. So we got Fleets. He's got just a weak finalizer team. He's got on like he's put nothing on defense. He's, which is what I was. It didn't even matter if he put his best teams on, on defense. My secondary fleets are good. You know, you'll see in a second. I'm just kind of surprised at how weak that Akbar team is. All right, we're going to try my Jedi Knight Revan. Bring in Jedi Knight Luke. Not crazy about it. I just, I probably should have done the, f no, foresight right now. Now we mark. Luke will be going in a second. Stun everyone.
So we're going to start bringing down these stacks. We need to get a strategic advantage off of Hermit. And it's useless over on Hermit. Swap with Yoda. Okay. You need to start bringing down that protection on Droidica. This is going to be bad. Why are you missing? Let's see if we can bring down that turn me I don't want that all right this is gonna be a win at least And now I, I got nothing here. I wonder if I... If I had C-3PO, I wonder if I could do anything. Let's just see if we can take several teams and chip away at this. I don't... I don't think we have enough. Bring in three ba three Baka here is my next gearing priority other than other than building up my relics. Alright. Yeah. Let's just start throwing in teams. Sure. I'm not putting in inevitable failure on anyone right now. Let's just swap this with Vader. I need, really, everything is going to come down to Vader doing as much. Come on! I should, maybe I should have done Merciless Massacre first. Can I? I can't self target.
That's something I want to practice. Seeing how I can best use Vader up against that team. All right, we'll give Bounty Hunters a shot. We're going to use Aura Singh, though, since her contract is faster. Not that it'll matter. We're not going to get to the contract going off. Let's just... We'll do trail. Oh. Yeah, that's it. There's nothing left. We will severely underman these teams. The finalizer is by far the harder one. So they'll get the rebels. We'll, we'll throw in one reinforcement. I don't even know if we'll get to it. Okay. We'll use Thrawn. Actually, we will use Tarkin. He's got better synergy with those Empire ships.
All right, he's going. We're gonna leave this running. Actually, no, I'm gonna pause this, let him do a few battles, unpause it, and then we'll show you how he does before we wrap up this video and I post it. So he is now attacking the top territory, which is what I wanted him to do. He's taken two teams against my first order, so we're already in good position on banners in the event that he does clear out these first two territories and goes after the back wall, but I don't think he has anything to go up against my Grievous, which is what I was saying, other than Padme would be his best team left. His CLS has no relics. Like Those were all his relics, and Padme might be on that back wall. Now taking out this older public team, which is no surprise, and had trouble up against my newt team. Which usually which very often comes through for me. I don't even know if he's gonna make an attempt against Grievous. Too much on defense. Like, this all-out defense strategy works if you have s enough left over to at least take out a couple meta teams. There's nothing he has that can work up against Grievous. And I'm assuming now he's not going to be able to handle this new team either. We're gonna let him battle that. I'm going to. Did I already claim this stuff yet? We will pause and come back after that battle's done. I don't wanna just r let the timer run while he's doing these battles. Okay, he's taken out the new team. He's had to use two teams against two of my defenses, and now he's got nothing that I can handle these teams. Like that final, yeah, that's one thing we can look at. I think that finalizer team was, I mean, he's got Thrawn, which he's not using correctly. There's Thrawn and Tarkin are basically his options, and there's not enough ships between those two fleets. Then we're looking at, like, Vader. Guess maybe he can be using Mace Windu, but Mace can't handle any of those fleets. Like, I don't even think he can take out one of my fleets. I think victory is pretty safe to assume at this point. Although he's attempting Grievous, we will see if he is able to get through Grievous. But then on my back wall, let's assume that he somehow gets through Grievous and has something left. Then on my back wall, he's got to deal with Mon Mothma and with Padme which whatever he has already used, especially to get through both Treya and Grievous, yeah, he's, even if he's able to get through Grievous, he will have nothing left to take on Padme. All right, we're gonna wrap it up there. Victory is secured. We dropped two battles over the entirety of this grand arena we're gonna pick up this other feat here with with uh, the fleet arena battles 
this one here I think was the only one I missed out on I think we grabbed all the other feats so that is it for this video this has been still plays be safe out there everyone and be excellent to each other